Hello everybody, Domino Emil here, and welcome back to another episode of Parasite Eve. Last time we escaped from the hospital, Eve now has the sperm that she needs to give birth to the ultimate being. Still kind of a weird plot, but whatever. Uh, and so now I guess we're trying to stop her? We're trying to figure out where she went, I guess? I'm not really sure. It's <laughs> been about two weeks since I last recorded this. I know I said that I would try and keep this LP on a consistent pace, but I've obviously broken that because, god damn it, it is just so hard to keep the steam rolling the <laughs> when uh, recording LPs. I don't know how I did it during Bug Fables. I don't know how I managed to keep a consistent schedule for almost all of Bug Fables and like Cross Code and like my earlier LPs when I was still young and motivated. <laughs> God, I'm 22. I started recording when I was like 19. Ugh. Some time ago, a doctor at that hospital was fired for selling off patient records. And Melissa was seen going into the museum late at night several times? Eve? Clamp that bastard! I knew he was a part of this! We'll split up here and search the entire city. Eve and Clamp must be meeting soon. We must hurry. It'll be too late once the ultimate being is born. I'll go snoop around some more for any info. Brought you a walkie-talkie so we can keep in touch. Oh, thanks. Another slot in my inventory. I'm counting on you too, Mr. Scientist. Whoa! We'll all split up and look for Eve. You find any trace of her, and you call for backup. Weren't you going to stay here, Daniel? And push papers all day? You're kidding me. What will we do? Let us know if anything comes up. Uh, yeah, okay, I got it. Day 5, Evolution. Yeah, I'll say. Okay, what's going on now? Oh, the emulator kind of... Uh, I mean, the uh, Microsoft PlayStation 1 uh, stuttered for a little bit. Wait, we're going to Chinatown? Holy shit! Chinatown! <laughs> <laughs> I've never been to a Chinatown. Uh, or to Chinatown, no. Oh. Holy shit, what's going on here? This is the best looking area yet! And this music! Wait, shit, this is actually really cool. <laughs> Yeah, I like this area. This is a good area. I don't know if I'm supposed to be here yet, but we'll just say that I am. Uh, hello, our... our So, these guys have homing shots? Ah! Die. Please die. I also don't have any ammo. So this is definitely gonna be terrifying. I forgot that I have no ammo. But at least I have this cool gun to make up for- Okay. Please die. Please just die. 
Okay. Please drop ammo. I need it so badly. Holy shit, you're a lifesaver. Okay. Uh, which gun am I using? Is it? Yeah, it's the rifle. Wait, that was the wrong one. Wait, I just realized I can take out all the ammo and put it into the crate. So I do have more ammo than I thought. Like, I, I'm not going to be using any of these guns. And then the M92, I'm also not going to use. So let's just refill this one. Cool. So I have 40 bullets. I have more ammo than I thought once I actually get to micromanaging my inventory. It's just, uh, still, I'm pretty low on ammo. I really hope I'm supposed to be here. Uh... Snakes and foxes. Okay. Okay! Uh... Fuck. I think that's the one that I shot earlier. And then I gotta use Detox, of course. So... Uh, this game is still really loud in my ears. Turn down that volume. And what was I gonna use? Right, I was gonna use Detox. So, it has been a couple weeks since I last recorded. Um, of course, I told you guys last time that I have been busy with shit, but now I have, like, a few days where I can actually do shit and not have to worry about, uh, school and stuff. Uh, I'm in, like, a break between terms right now, and, uh, yeah, I decided now would probably be the best time to start recording this game and hopefully work on finishing it up. Uh... Oh, fuck you. Can I really not go in any of these areas? This is just a straight line. Oh, there's a... Offense 1. Okay. Uh, that might be useful on my, uh, weapon. Do I have anything else? No. I really should have put shit in storage while I was at the police department. Fuck. M792. What is that? Okay. Add acid effect to bullets. That's cool and all, but I'm still gonna stick to this. And then I'm going to use a tool, right. So I want to tune up this and then put this Yeah. Okay, that'll be good. That'll be good. Because with its slow rate of fire, it'll make up for, uh, with, uh, acid. Ooh, did I find a secret area? Is there anything here? There is. <laughs> Jeez. 
I know this is an RPG and you get like a ton of weapons and equipment and all that stuff. It's kind of standard fare. But at least with RPGs, at least all the weapons and armor have like standard names. And I get guns are just letters and numbers. But fuck, man. How am I supposed to differentiate the M1911A2 between the G3, G3 or whatever the fuck? Like, I don't even know what the hell half this shit means. I, uh... It has less range, it has less bullets. It probably has a fast rate of fire, that's probably what it has going for it, but like... It was kind of really hidden. Also, that room has no music for some reason. Ah, shit, I should have healed. No! Why am I back here? Uh... I guess snakes are immune to acid. Uh, okay. Oh, fuck me. Let's kill the snake. Avoid the fox. Don't get near me, snake. I thought I knew how to dodge those bullets, but I guess I don't. Okay, Acid is a pretty good status. Like, look at that damage! Holy shit! Fuck. I should have swerved. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah. No, that might be... No, that's that's definitely warranted. <clears throat> so, yeah. Uh, I don't know what to talk about. <laughs> um, I, f I got that job at the school, so I finally employed a Nomeo. But uh, we need to do this dialogue first before I can continue. Aya, it's here! Huh? It looks like rotten meat. I'm going down to have a look. Notify Daniel for me. Uh, yes, wait, here, take this. I don't need another good luck charm! Stop it, Maeda! You're taking up precious inventory space! I don't even know if the charms do shit! <sighs> Three precious inventory slots wasted because of you! Ugh. So yeah, uh, I'm finally employed. I mean, I haven't started working yet, that's in a couple days, but... Uh, yeah, I guess I just have to go through training during the break. And then I'll be working during school. Uh, or while also juggling school. So, it's gonna keep me busy, I guess. Lately, I've just kind of been dying of boredom, because I have nothing to do in my free time. Like, oh god. Uh... Fuck. I just want this bat to die. Ooh. Gonna produce a sound wave? Are you? Okay. Oh god. Wait, what the fuck? Is that blind? Oh no. That's just annoying. 
<laughs> I missed, but still fucking produced the toxic effect. Uh... How the hell do I... I guess I just energy shot these guys, because that'll go through uh, blindness. Uh... Okay. So yeah, uh, I'm going to be doing work while at school, while juggling schoolwork, and uh... hey, I'll finally be able to buy more games. And I'll finally be able to record some newer stuff. Like, I was thinking maybe I might just get Mario Wonder and uh, play that. Uh, without having to resort to... Uh... I'm not going to finish that. But yeah. Um... So that's going well. Uh, I did well in my classes. Except for the fact that... Uh... The last exam for general bio was on a day, of, like, <clears throat> it was on a Friday instead of a Saturday. Uh, you know, take the exam online and shit. And I thought for certain that, like, you know, uh, it would be on a Saturday because that's where all the other exams were. Um... You are fucking kidding me. But yeah, I basically thought that my exam was going to be uh, on a Saturday, because that's what it's been on the like past several weeks. And so, like, yeah, no, like, I was tired on Friday, like, yeah, I'm not going to do my exam early, like usual. So I just kind of decided, eh, I'll do it tomorrow. Why the fuck not? Because... I don't know. Tired. So, yeah. Uh, I, as a result, I missed turning in my exam, which isn't a very interesting story, but it is something to talk about. Uh, I don't know. I guess in other news, there's been a Nintendo Direct the past month. Uh, I didn't really care about it all that much. It had, uh, what did it even have? I know it had the TTYD remake, which everyone is going fucking crazy about, but... <clears throat> uh, I'm actually of the camp that TTYD isn't actually that good of a game. Mediocre at best. Um, I have, like, a whole list of reasons why I don't think TTYD is that good. I actually... Okay, TTYD is a good game as far as the battle system goes. Everything else about the game is just shit. Seriously. Uh. Uh. Like, I don't... Like, there's so much fucking annoying backtracking in Thousand Year Door that, like, I feel like the game actively disrespects the player's time. And... <clears throat> Sorry, I have a bit of a cough. <clears throat> uh, 
Yeah, but as I was saying, TTYD actively disrespects the player's time by making the player backtrack so many fucking times. Even within, like, its own, like, designated chapters. It's just, like... So tedious and frustrating. And then the pacing of the game is also fucking dog shit. Like, it's not just the backtracking that ruins the pacing, it's just the normal ass game that's also shitty with pacing. So, like, I don't know, I think Glitzville is probably the prime example of pretty bad pacing. All battles, like, no real overworld exploration. Or, like, NPC dialogue. Well, there is NPC dialogue, but it's all just condensed. You can't feel like you're doing anything in that chapter without having to constantly battle. And then the battles themselves have stupid criteria, which are supposed to make the battles more interesting, more fitting of the theme of a whole, like, wrestling arena. But half the time it just makes the battles worse. Like, if you're gonna put some conditions on a battle, make it so it's, like, interesting. Like, maybe you have to use a certain badge, or maybe you have to use a certain partner. Or maybe, like, instead of, like, appealing three times to the audience, uh, you have to, uh, do stylish moves. Uh, or attempt to. Or, like, do a certain amount of stylish moves. Or maybe do a specific stylish move. I don't know. But, like, there are definitely so many ways to fix the problem with Chapter 3. Chapter 4 is just an abomination. I'm not going to go over it. Um, chapter 5 is okay. Chapter 6... Just a... Chapter 6 is just an arbitrary sequence of flags that doesn't make any fucking sense. Like, you have to talk to this NPC, then that one, then this one, and that, so on and so forth, until it's just, like... Yeah, okay. Cool. Thanks. Is this a maze? I didn't really... Piece that together until recently. Or just now. Okay, but, like, can you stop, frog? <clears throat> eh! Stop chasing me! I don't like these tight spaces. I don't know, so I made my point. I don't like TTYD. And... <laughs> while I'm not really a contrarian... Okay, maybe I am kind of a contrarian in life, but while I don't really consider myself a contrarian, I will say that <clears throat> seeing everybody so fucking happy about TTYD being remade and not even questioning, like, why isn't 64 being remade? Or, like, <clears throat> I don't know. Why isn't 64 being remade? I'd much rather prefer a 64 remake than TTYD, because it's just a more well-balanced game, and it needs the remake more. Because if you're going to fix the issues with TTYD, you'd have to fundamentally change the game, because the problems with it are essential to the game experience. Like, you can't have TTYD without annoying backtracking. You can't have TTYD without annoying chapters, like the Punies. I don't know. Um, and also, I think the writing in TTYD just isn't that amazing. It's a little bit too quirky. And while being quirky isn't bad, if you're gonna be quirky, try and do a color splash kind of thing, where you're just constantly bombarding, where it's not supposed to be taken seriously, you're just kind of making quips all the time. I mean, Color Splash has its own problems with its writing, but, like, I'd argue Color Splash is just as good a game of TTYD, if not even more so, because the writing and the music make up for it all. 
even if the actual game itself is shit. TTYD doesn't have music. At least 64 has fucking music. Like, <laughs> why the fuck does the TTYD have any actual background music besides the battle theme, chapter one, and like, the chapter seven dungeon? It's just fucking weird. Club 3? What does Club 3 do? First attack! Huh. Okay, the clubs might actually be good, but I'm not going to equip that. But I am going to use a tool. Do I have any more tools? No, I do not have any more tools. Wait, no, I probably do. So I'm going to tune up this one. And I'm going to... Shit! I forgot, I can't use clubs! I am tempted to combine the Tranquilizer Dart with the Acid Dart, but I feel like that would kind of counteract each other. Right, no, that's just full of medicine now. <clears throat> so, yeah. Uh, I don't know. It's just a little part of me, the little demon inside me gets a little bit fed up when YouTubers freak out about TTYD being remade, especially, like, the likes of Arlo. Like, I don't mean to be mean to the guy, because I don't know anything about him, and I did used to watch him, but... Man, his fan base is so fucking toxic. Man, he hates Paper Mario so much except for TTYD and 64 and like, Super that he fucking disregards the fan base that likes the modern games. It's like, don't fucking judge a person for the games they like. And don't fucking, like, be so fucking proud that you got your favorite game remade, even though I feel like you might have been partially responsible for that because you didn't shut up about it. And the rest of the pa uh, Paper Mario fan base. <clears throat> That's why I don't like associating with the Paper Mario fan base. I like most of the games, I just don't like the people. <laughs> Sorry, anybody in the fan base. It's the audience from Central Park. Oh no! I got a comment on the first episode saying, uh, the body horror in this game is actually, like, much better than popular horror games like uh, Resident Evil. I'm not disagreeing. I just think the graphics, the PS1 graphics are a little bit outdated. Also, just not the type of horror that affects me. I had to get the slime out of the reservoir before it infects the whole city! Okay. Is there a battle here? There better not be a battle here. What the fuck are these? Who are you? Oh no, he's moving faster. Holy shit! A laser? Excuse me? I have no healing. Right, that last boss really did do a number on me. Uh, I'll use Barrier. Ooh. Okay. 
Okay. I just need to work on killing these guys. Slowly but surely. I'm not gonna die to these motherfuckers. Okay. Shoot him. That did nothing because it was just out of my range. Uh, shoot the tail. Don't you dare fucking come close to me. Okay. Okay. I got these guys, I think. I'm really hoping my parasite energy fills. Oh god! I thought that laser had infinite rage, and I'm so glad it did not. Holy shit. Oh, that scared me. Critical evade and rain. You know what? That might be good. So, let's get that critical evade. Or let's just use the range on this. Where's my critical evade? Do I not have it? What? Do I have any... Huh. Interesting. Okay, okay. I clearly see which wheel I have to touch, because it's the one that's... No. Okay, that's not the right one to touch. Wait, then what am I doing down here? I thought I was supposed to, like... Do something water flow. Because I can't go down into the water. Okay. Huh. I guess this battle is just for a tool. <laughs> okay. I'll take it, I guess. More tools, the better. I just wish I had healing. I am. Okay. And I do. That is so good. So good! Because that's all I'm relying on right now. Huh. <sighs> What's going on here? Whoa. God, door sound effects. Why are they always so loud in these games? Wait, what? Fuck! Yeah, turn it on. Activate pump 2. There's not enough power. Activate pump one! What? what? Um... Okay! Shit. That was a phone. Okay. Why do I keep accidentally skipping dialogue? Hmm. Ammo 
30. Well, okay. This was kind of a weird episode. I just kind of ranted about TTYD. Uh, in the next episode, we'll go see what's happening with the goo and if we caused a citywide catastrophic destruction. Uh, in the next episode of Parasite Eve. Bye bye. <laughs>